cold over there. Got the hood on. <laughs> God, sweatshirt. So comfy. Oh no, is it sweatshirt weather weather already? Dude, it's a hundred percent sweatshirt weather. This morning I woke up, it was like sixty degrees. It's in the mid seventies outside. It's still warm. It's joggers and um shorts or shorts and hoodie. Joggers and t shirts, my god. Joggers and t shirts. Shorts and hoodies. That's yeah. the answer we're looking for. Really? Well, that's when it's below eighty. When it's below eighty, that's oh, what it is. Gotcha. I gotcha. Any beloved just shorts at that point? I don't know. Depends on the, depends on the day. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, I could be wearing jeans. Who knew? Who knows? She's in a t-shirt. And not You're going to wear jeans in 90 degree weather? Yeah. He once sent me a happy birthday Snapchat of yeah, him wearing yeah. jeans in 80. It was 87 degrees. How he goes, yeah. happy birthday. Your birthday present from me this year is a picture of me in jeans. In my defense, though, I wasn't in Pennsylvania when it was your birthday, so I couldn't provide you anything. This is true. But then, is true. Ever, since, was, ever, since then ever since then, I always request one birthday Snapchat of, of that, of that uh, you know, level. Of that caliber? Oh, of that caliber. Thank you. I couldn't think of the oh, word. Of that it. caliber to, from Brian to me. Okay. I provide it every year. There you go. Yeah. Hey, he 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 has not let me down. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's starting to become like it's getting like chilly now at night. So I'm like, yeah, yeah. Oh, we're jogging and stuff like that. We go out. Just, yeah. Oh, there you go. I know summer's over now. I know. Yeah. So like, I've been so like I've been seeing like all these people like who I know while I have full time jobs are like. Oh, so it's that summer's over. I'm like, you had a summer? <laughs> What's that like? And, and like, because for the past like three months, I've been seeing these people at like the beach every day. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, in the middle of the day, they're at the beach. I'm like, you're at the beach from like 10 a.m. to like three. Do you not work? What do you do? What do you do? Because like, you're on the beach. Like, d- just, just tell me if you're working or not. Yeah. I, I'm assuming you're not. If you are. I'd, ima- no. I'd imagine that they are not considered in fact that they're laying on the beach consistently for several days. I mean, if that is your office, though, how can you not work there? <laughs> I mean, like, it's not like they're on the beach, like, here and there. or It's, no, it's, it's, it's like, like consistently. It's, it's like each they're day. at the beach every day for, like, a month. I'm like, you didn't take a month off. I know that for a fact. <laughs> like, how are you? Like, I don't know. I see it and I'm like, I'm jealous. Mm-hmm. And I don't know how you're doing it. And I want to know how you're doing it because I want to do that. So I'm like, uh, I don't know. I want that life. I mean, technically, I can work remotely and work by the beach. I mean, that's what we're doing like, probably sometime in February. I'm going to get down to my Florida house and be like, just work down there for like a week or two. That's smart. But that's actually really smart. That, that's a, that's uh, a like, good I'm, move. I'm going to go down to work and then I'm going to go to the beach at like 5 p.m. Uh-huh. We'll hop off our five, drive 10 minutes to the beach, less than 10 minutes to the beach. Rub in everyone's off. face. Yeah. Or I go to the pool hot tub at night. Or, you know, like during the day, just go to the pool hot tub. Because everyone down there, because there's no kids down there. Because because the house is in development. Oh, uh, yeah. There's, there's no kids allowed. Yeah, nice. Basically, they're all retired. All the mm-hmm. kids, Dang it. Well, I can't go. There. So, damn. All the people are already retired down there. So, like, the only people kids would go would be like the grandkids. Yeah. So I'm like, that's pretty nice though. It's sometimes weird when I first went down there. They'd be like, "Who are you?" I'm like, "I, I my family owns the house here." Yeah. <laughs> so I can be here. No keys. I have the keys oh. to prove it. <laughs> it's like it's like when that college kid asked you, "Who do you know when you uh, live at the there? party?" Yeah. 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 <laughs> um. Oh, yeah, I'll probably do that sometime in like February after the Super Bowl. Yeah. Yeah, probably go down for a little quick and get mm-hmm. Enjoy the nice warm weather. I sent you guys 80 degree snap weather, Snapchats. Please don't. Please do. It's going nice. to make me more sad. <laughs> We're here the out. worst. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, but, and it makes you feel better. I'll probably hate myself when I come back up here. It's very, very, back very in the cold. Yeah, when I come back, it's going to be like negative 20 degrees and I'm going to you want to jump out my window every yeah. day. Or depending on where you're going in February. Because if you're going by the Super Bowl, it's like what mid-February by the time you come back, late February or almost springtime. This is it doesn't get warm until like April. 
March is still pretty cold. It even is, but April you slowly get more like 40, 50 where, degrees. Right. Like even, more even April has its moments where it's it can be a little brisk. Oh, yeah, definitely. I've played in March for a week. It's not warm. It is freezing. Yeah, I'm good. It's freezing. It's because mm-hmm. it's like it's like still 30 degrees. And then April is just kind of like early like, April. It's just rainy and wet. And it sucks. And it's not warm enough for you to enjoy it. It's just like still like 50. So you're like, it would be fine. And it's windy too. Yeah. So like, it, it's like, it's fine if there was no rain or wind. At that point, like, it's 40, 40 degrees. I could deal. Mm-hmm. Once you add like the rain or the wind, you're like, y'all, this. Yeah, mm-hmm. no, that, then it's it's just downright freaking miserable. It's like, you know what? I, you know, I, I, I didn't want to go outside anyway today. It's fine. It's like basically from like, I would say mid January to early, early, uh, early April kind of sucks. It does. Yeah. Cause like January is not bad. Cause usually it's still pretty sunny outside. Like it is. Yeah. It's like, it might be cold and you may have ice and rain and stuff like that snow, but at least the sun's still out. Exactly. The rest of the time. And then the rest like, is just depressing because the sun doesn't stay for any length of time. Exactly. And then like once it hits like mid January, you just don't see the sun for like mm-hmm. up two months. And then when you step just, outside, it's cold as shit. Or like, I'm not yeah. going out there. If you look outside, you're like, oh look, it's gray outside. And then <laughs> I want to go out you know, there. You just know it's cold. Just like that you looks see flat the out. Yeah, that looks flat out and miserable. Mm-hmm. I'm not going to do it. I'm gonna need an extra that. sweatshirt. God damn it! <laughs> Seriously though, that's the thing I love though. Like sometimes about weather, you can look outside, you can just see the weather. It's like when it's mm-hmm. hot outside, like definitely when Jeff and I worked at camp, like you could look outside and you'd be like, "Yo, it's hot." It's gonna be. It's gonna be a day. Mm-hmm. It, it's gonna. Or even just like the cold, like we just said, like you can look outside, like yo, that's gonna be cold. Mm-hmm. That's gonna be miserable. Well, or if you can even see out the window if there's no ice on it. (laughs) This is true, too. I will say, though, like, I have more winter clothing than summer clothing. Congratulations. Like, my my attire is so much better for the winter. Like, I have my jeans, I have boots, I have different, you know, I have five, six different shoes to wear in the sun, like, when it's cold outside. But in the summer, I have, like, sneakers. That's all I have. I, I I gotta ask you five or six different t- pairs of shoes to wear during the winter alone. How many do you need, Jeff? Yeah, I, I Honestly, I just wear my Tims and that's it. <laughs> I, have, uh, I have a pair of rock ports. I have <clears throat> black rock ports. I have Tim. I have um, two like dress uh, boots. I have a pair of dress shoes that are for like the winter. Um. And then I have like jeans, I have sweats, and then I have like hoodies, I have peak, I have like three pea coats. Yeah, you and your pea coats, I forgot you, you have those. So like well, because a lot of people will wear actual like like winter coats, and I don't like that. That's weird. <laughs> I, 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 That's so weird at winter time. I feel like a I feel like a marshmallow when I wear one. I feel like I'm a show. It's true that like literally when dude, especially like, like during that, dur- yeah, no, dude, during his school, just swaddling everywhere. I hate you. <laughs> you're, you're like the kid in a Christmas story, the younger brother just like waddles back and front falls down. But no, he's like seriously, especially like during high school though, like I hated wearing the winter jackets because it's like one, it was so freaking hard to store them in your locker, but two in general. You had you looked, room. You looked weird as hell. Like oh, well, he's hot as shit. Back. So whenever you get in, you're like, "Well, I can't wear this coat anymore." <laughs> and it can't fit in your I, I locker. Had a big locker. I had a big locker for all four years, though. So, so I, I had a small locker. No, oh, I, so. I could fit my locker. <laughs> it's true. With all my with my stuff in, I could fit in my locker. We've, we've tested this before. I'm pretty we did, sure. Right? Yes, we did. We did. Um, but yeah, I always have more clothing for the winter, which I enjoy wearing because I wear like so. I go out to do something, I'll wear like Tim's. Um, I'll wear like jeans. I still have my ripped jeans on. I still wear that in the winter. But I'll, wear that. Nuts. I'll wear a hoodie, like a this kind of hoodie or like a, bl- a plain like black, mm-hmm. gray or whatever hoodie I have like fun. And I'll wear like my black pea coat over it. 
So it's not like, so I'm not like yeah. a huge marshmallow, but I'm still warm enough. And then I can take the I'm not a huge hot. marshmallow. I love it. So I always compare myself to if like I want to wear this big, like, skinny yeah, I guess I'm like, you know, I feel like a, I feel so bloated in this. I hate it. <laughs> so I don't know. But I love the winter more. I mean, I love the summer more. Yeah, so do I. I still have the clothing for it because all I wear it's is like... shorts. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you're not wrong, but I'm kind of glad that summer's coming to an end because I, I, I don't want any more like 90 plus degree weather anymore. Uh, you know, I'm talk about Halloween, even though it's September. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Actually, they'll, they'll just skip Halloween and go right to Christmas. No, that's October. I, Fair enough. Have I, I actually haven't had to go to work in like the snow in almost like three years. Must be nice. <laughs> All right. To be fair, you are literally right there. Unless there's so much snow. I caught that, out. I've caught out before because of snow. I was going to say a, a couple of reasons. One, unless a the there's so much snow, you literally cannot like get out of your place or you can't mm-hmm. get there or be like the, the roads are too slippery or whatever. That's a legitimate you know, reason. But if you look outside, you're like, yeah, it's snowing. I don't want to go. <laughs> Especially yeah, if you're never right there done when that before, <laughs> maybe once. <laughs> I just don't think I have the same boat. I haven't, there's a time period no one worked because it was COVID for like four months or more. And that was during the summer. Mm-hmm. So if you did get a new job, you probably got in this fall. So then you had to work in the, you know, like the winter, but most, most companies were remote. Online, yeah. So, like, I mean, I went in every now and then, and then I had to go start going in, and then until I told them I couldn't come in, because they literally, because for my old apartment complex, they, they literally paid, they, they um, paved the entire, like, so plowed the entire uh, parking lot, but they bur- buried all of our cars. Nice. Every single car was covered. So they just took, they took the middle and just like, just like, screw it. This is fine. And no one could leave. So we had, like, we had a huge snowstorm and my car had about like four feet of snow behind it. And I'm like, I, and then I started digging it out with a, with a pan because I don't have a, I don't have a shovel. And you know, it's really bad when like you're doing that. And then the lady comes up, the lady came up to me. She's like, she's like, honey. And I have my hair, it probably like, you know, I'll just throw it. Yeah. Like, Kathy, she, and I was like, oh, what's up? And I took it out and she's like, Honey, like, do you not have a shuffle? Like, <laughs> what gave that away? <laughs> and I'm sitting here, like, I'm a 26 year old man. And this lady just asked me, like, honey, as I thought I was like, a 10 year old. And I was like, like no, your I grandma. don't. Yeah. And I was like, no, I don't. And she's like, I'll be right back. And I'm like, okay. And she brought me a shovel. She's like, you can use this whenever you want. I'll leave it outside for you. I'm like, I can fend for myself. Yeah. Sure. I'm completely. She, cool. she, she's, she's, she's pretty much treating you as if you're like a helpless little five year old. It's like, it's like, a- in that sense, I mean, that's how he was I mean, feeling that's at that sense because he yeah. was pulling, he was trying to get his car out with the pan. Yeah. If my car was stuck, I just would have said, fuck it. I'm calling out or I'm working online. I'm not going in. I, but I knew that another storm was coming and I wanted to get out because I wanted to get beer. And then you <laughs> Makes sense. <laughs> And I needed food, so that was the other part of it. You tore dash alcohol. I'm 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 glad that you you put beer in front of food first. That's the priority. The necessities, a- Jeff. The necessities. <laughs> I understand. I mean, you have to stay just- hydrated. That's the most important thing. <laughs> Staying hydrated or dehydrated. I mean, that's a good beer with water in it. Yeah. True. Not a lot. Not a lot. No. I'm a very simple person. You guys both know this. Give me a beer. I'd be happy. 